Now to a story you asked us to investigate. A lot of us here in the Valley live in a neighborhood with an HOA. Well, with that can come some frustrations. Something one Summerlin woman knows all too well after going to war for months over a tree. 13 Action News reporter Annalise Ortiz shows us how she's now finally seeing some results. A picturesque backyard, but look closer and you'll notice. You can see where the wall here is buckling up and it's kind of making a domino effect all the way down. She says these tree roots are the reason why the wall is damaged, but it's also causing issues with the irrigation system. All of the staining that you're seeing here on the ground is from the roots coming up underneath, so therefore she's got a lot of leaks going on. For months, Carla Carter's devoted time and energy to fixing this mess, all for her close friend who lives here, but was too afraid of her own HOA to talk to us. She's an elderly person. She can't do this on her own. It's not fair. It's not right. Carla says the out of control tree roots cost her thousands of dollars, money she believes she shouldn't have to spend because the tree isn't on her property. When she told that to the summer Summerlin HOA. They said it was a city's issue, so therefore when we contacted the city, the city said no, it's not our issue, it's the HOA. So it's basically everybody's pointing fingers back and forth. We called the HOA ourselves. A representative tells us they are working to fix the tree root problems and they will pay for the damaged wall, but Carla doesn't know if their response will go deep enough. Who is going to pay for what is still happening underneath caused by the tree roots and the damage that it's done? We have tips at KTNV.com about what you can do if you have a dispute with your HOA. Reporting in Summerlin, Annalise Ortiz, 13 Action News. New tonight, if you want to make some extra